<laughs> I hate that sound. My voice. Okay. You guys ready? Yes. Okay. So, let me put this guy back together. All right. We have... So you, you can see this muscle right here. That's part of that trapezius muscle. So it goes one, this one is this part of the second one. Oh, there it goes. And on the neck. So that makes up all of the trapezius. Dang, that's how long. And then you have the latissimus dorsi. So it's different. So you notice the trapezius is superficial to the latissimus dorsi. Okay. And then if you transect through the trapezius muscles, you go deeper, then you'll get the chance to see um, the muscles that are attached to the scapula, to the vertebral column. You notice this got cut, um, so connect, being connected right here would be the rhomboid major, and then you have the one close to the head is the rhomboid minor. The muscle above the spine of the scapula right here is the supraspinatus. The one below it is infraspinatus. And then you have the muscle that's next to that, which is the teres minor. And then under the scapula itself is the subscapularis. All right, we couple muscles on the arm that we didn't go over. Uh, we had talked about the pectoralis major. Um, so this one right here is the brachialis, this one. Deeper to that is where the biceps brachii is, but we would need to transect it. So that's where the biceps brachii is. You guys can see it. This one's not exposed right now but that's the biceps brachii. On the lateral side of the forearm, that's where the brachialis is. This right here, that's part of the triceps brachii. 